Before the video starts, please don't forget to like it if you enjoy, and also please be sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget the bell so that you can get more of my videos. And also, if you would like to support me, check out my Patreon which is on the card in the top right corner, or check the description. Reverse Flash is one of the most iconic supervillains of the Flash franchise. We know how cool he looks in the show, and we know how awesome and extravagant his plans were to getting back to his future. And don't lie, you were also pretty surprised by this. It's good to see you again, General. Who are you? Who am I? Harrison. I was like... Oh no! God! No! God! Please, no! 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 But there is one question that hasn't been answered yet. How fast is the Reverse Flash from CW? First, I'm going to be looking at Reverse Flash or Eobard Thawn from the Flash series on CW. Now watch this scene. In order to find his speed, we need to use the formula velocity equals distance divided by time. Let's do time first because it's actually the easier one to find here. Like in my video covering Savitar, we need to find Barry's perception of time at that point in time in the show. This is the clip closest to the reverse flash scene showing Barry's perception of time. So, in the scene, the pistol bullet travels around 2 feet and 1 second. The bullets normally travel at 2,500 feet per second. So, we simply divide 2,500 by 2, and we see that Barry sees things 1,250 times slower. In the show, it takes them 8.5 seconds to run around the perimeter of the stadium. So, to find how much time the scene really took place over, we divide 8.5 seconds by 1,250, which is Barry's perception of time, to get 0 0.0068 seconds. To find the distance is a bit harder though. That's what she said. <laughs> Michael. Michael. <laughs> Michael, please. There he is. Please. All jokes aside, let's highball and say they ran around the whole stadium one time. My calculations will be somewhat approximate. It took place on the high school football field located in Central City. Thankfully, high school football stadiums are extremely similar to each other. Here are the dimensions of most high school football fields, and here is the field shown in this show. They ran around the stadium in about the middle of the bleachers, so we use the stadium formula for perimeter, which is perimeter equals 2 times pi times r plus a. Based off the high school football field measurements and dimensions, I was able to scale that the perimeter that they ran is actually 541 yards. Now we substitute both of our values in and we can see that they can run at 79,989.705 yards per second. This simplifies down to 213 times faster than sound. However, the show has many inconsistencies and if I power scale his speed plot wise, he would be somewhere around Mach 2. This is because in Season 1, Barry went about Mach 2, which was his max speed, and when Barry fought Eobard, he was still losing. Hopefully you enjoyed, please be sure to subscribe if you did, and also please be sure to check out my previous videos. If you have any questions or comments, just comment them down below, and have a nice day.